so in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to get the cop belt but this time for the cop belt you're going to have a black shirt stuck on your outfit i'm not sure how to fix that yet but for now you're going to have a black shirt stuck on top of your outfit and i'm going to show you guys what that looks like and also we're going to be doing the outfit transfer glitch and remember that with the outfit transfer glitch you do lose all your outfits except for only one so before you start make sure you put on the outfit that you don't want to lose also make sure you gone to ammunition and bought either a rebreather or an earpiece whichever one and when you're ready to start the glitch come to the clothing store set your spawn location to last location hit your pause button go to online and go to swap character so once you get inside of here all you want to do is go over to your second character when you come over to your second character it's either going to say edit or delete if it says delete under your second character just go ahead and delete your second character and then two new characters will walk in and then you're going to get an edit option under your second character once you got the edit option under your second character just go ahead and select it when he or she is going you're going to get an alert that's going to ask you to transfer your stuff over just go ahead and accept it when you get inside of here if your second character ended up being a male just change it into a female but if it was already a female leave it as a female go ahead and save it continue make a random name for it and then take the picture after you take the picture and it's loading it may or may not play the casino dlc trailer for me it's not gonna play it but for some of you guys it may play it. whether it plays it or not it's not going to affect the glitch you're just waiting to get spawned inside of your new session and just real quick if you don't have anything that you want to put the cop belt on stay till the end of the video because i'm going to give you the component for the uh black joggers so you don't got to start up any job or anything for the black joggers Once you get spawned inside your new session, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up your map and check to see if there are any clothing stores in your session. If you don't see any clothing stores in your session, all you got to do is switch sessions or find a new session and then the clothing stores are going to be inside that new session. But if you do see the clothing stores in your session, make your way over to the nearest one. So once again, if you don't see any clothing stores, switch sessions, find a new session, but if you do see the clothing stores, just go to the nearest one. So once you get inside the clothing store, first go to the top section, go to work jackets, and buy the peach camo clothes field. So just come over here to the tops. Go to work jackets and buy the peach camo clothes field. Once you have that, just go ahead and back out. Stay in the top section. Go to gun running. Excuse me. Go to gun running t-shirts and buy the blue digital t-shirt. So just go to the gun running t-shirts and buy the blue digital t-shirt. Once you got that, make your way over to the pants. Go to sport pants and buy the spotted muscle pants. So just come over to the um, pants section go to the sport pants and buy the spotted muscle pants all right so now for the shoes i'm not sure what um, pants you guys are going to put them on but if you're going to use joggers i'm going to give you some options if you want the blue deadline shoes buy the worn black slack boots if you want the green deadline shoes buy the ox blood slack boots if you want the orange deadline shoes buy the chocolate slack boots if you want pink deadline shoes buy the worn ox blood slack boots and if you want the red deadline shoes buy the worn chocolate slack boots and lastly if you want the yellow deadline shoes buy the black slack boots and if you want the um like the sports sneakers with the socks buy the high heel deluxe midnight combat which is going to be in either the high heels or the high heel boot section if you don't care about the shoes just buy any one of them and then you could probably change it later but anyway, once you got the shoes, just go ahead and come take your earrings off your outfit. Once you take your earrings off, just go ahead and save it. And when you save it, make sure you save it in the empty slot that's on your main character. So if the outfit that you didn't want to lose on your main character was on slot 20, you'll just save this in a different slot. 
Once you got that, just hit your back button, go to standard outfits, and buy the Chica outfit. Once you got the Chica outfit, just go ahead and back out, hit your pause button, go to online, and click on creator. Once you get loaded inside of creator, click on create a race and then click on land race. Once you get loaded in, click on race details, go ahead and fill out the title and the description. There don't have to be anything specific, I just put in random stuff for it. After that, go ahead and take the photo, put the maximum players on 2, and then set the root type on point to point. Once you got that, hit your pause button, open up your map, and warp over to the airport. Once you get to the airport, just hit your back button, so be your circle, click on placement, click on place triggers, go ahead and place it down, back out of that, click on lobby camera, go ahead and take it, and then back out of that, and then click on checkpoints. Now when you um, make the race, it doesn't matter how many checkpoints you place down, as long as the race is 0.62 miles or longer, so just go ahead and make the race 0.62 miles or longer. Once you got that, just hit your back button, so be your circle twice. And then it's going to give you the option to test out the race and you just want to go ahead and test it out. Once you finish the race, you're going to get this completed alert, just go ahead and accept it. Once you load in, hit your pause button, go to online, and go to choose character. Once you get inside of here, you're going to go over to your female character and you're going to delete her. So make sure you go over to your female character because you don't want to delete your main character by accident. Go over to the girl that got the chica outfit on and you're going to delete her. Once you delete your female character, two new characters will walk in. From here, hit either B or circle so it takes you into single player. Once you get loaded inside of single player, all you're going to do is hit your pause button, go to online, go to play GT online, and just go inside of an invite only session. So all you're doing in single player is going inside of an invite only session. Once you get loaded inside your online session, the first thing you want to do is save the outfit that you didn't want to lose. So wherever you spawn that, the first thing you want to do is save the outfit that you didn't want to lose. And when you save it, make sure you save it towards the bottom slot. Right now, I'm just um, taking off the paramedic belt so I can just have the white joggers by itself. So make sure you save your outfit that you didn't want to lose because it's not going to be saved. And when you save it, make sure you save it towards the bottom.
so for the people that want to um, put the cop belt on the black joggers just come over here to the pants go to utility pants and buy the black heist pants yeah so just come over here to the utility pants and buy the black heist pants and these are going to be black joggers anyway once you got your outfit that you want to put the cop belt on just go ahead and hit your pause button go to online go to jobs play jobs rockstar created go to versus and start up crooked cops when you start up crooked cops make sure you put the clothing on player owned or the glitch will not work so once again make sure you put the clothing on player owned when you start up crooked cops or the glitch will not work and then invite either a friend or a random to join once you get inside of here just go down to owned outfits hit right on the d-pad once and then you're gonna have the invisible torso with the cop belt but it's obviously not gonna be like that so just go ahead and ready up once you've hit right on the d-pad once once you get inside the mission all you got to do is open up your interaction menu go to your styles go to your accessories and put on either a rebreather or an earpiece whichever one you decide to buy and then you want to back out open up your phone and quit the job from your phone So once you get loaded inside your um, session, you just want to wait for a few seconds and then you're going to get a black shirt on top of your outfit. You could try running to the clothing store, but you're not going to make it in time. So when you get a black shirt, all you want to do is hit your pause button, go to online, go to jobs, play jobs, rockstar created, go to missions, and you want to start up a titan of a job. And you could do this by yourself, you don't got to invite anybody else. So just go ahead and start up a titan of a job when you get the um, black shirt on your outfit and just go ahead and start the job by yourself and i did try out that method from the last video where i tried switching sessions for the paramedic belt to come on my outfit but it wouldn't work with the cop belt maybe it's gonna work for you guys i'm not sure once you get inside of a tight of a job you're gonna have the invisible arms with the um, cop belt so from here you just want to go ahead and save the outfit now the arms are not gonna stay invisible but you could keep on re-equipping the outfit if you want to but that's up to you so just make sure you come save the outfit and yeah that's gonna be it for the video and you can also change the pants to jeans or whatever you want so if you guys enjoyed it and liked it don't forget to drop a like on it that sounds so dumb but don't forget to drop a like on it share subscribe if you already haven't and don't forget to turn your post notifications so you don't miss out on further videos so once you save the outfit just go ahead and open up your phone and leave the job um from your phone